Welcome to Tech CJ's Video Notebook. In today's video, we're diving into how to wire smart light switches, including setups with and without a neutral wire. Whether you're building your first smart home or upgrading your old switches, this video will help you understand what to look for, how to wire safely, and how to avoid common flickering problems with LED lights. Let's start with the basics. Here you see a conventional mechanical switch. When flipped, it completes the circuit allowing electricity to flow through the light bulb. These switches usually only have a live or line wire in the switch box. There's no neutral wire present here, which becomes important when switching to smart devices. Watch the animation to understand better. Follow the wiring lines, the devices utilized, and its functions. This is the ideal smart switch configuration with both live and neutral wires. The switch stays powered at all times, even when the light is off, allowing it to connect to Wi-Fi or Zigbee. This is the most reliable setup for smart switches with no capacitor required. Watch the animation to understand better. Follow the wiring lines, the devices utilized, and its functions. In many older homes, only the live wire reaches the switch box. This type of no neutral setup requires a capacitor across the bulb to allow a small trickle of current to power the smart switch when the light is off. This prevents flickering and keeps the switch connected. Watch the animation to understand better. Follow the wiring lines, the devices utilized, and its functions. When using multiple bulbs with a known neutral smart switch, you only need to install the capacitor in parallel with one of the bulbs. This stabilizes the circuit and eliminates flickering for all connected lights. Make sure to use an X2 rated capacitor with at least 275V AC rating. Watch the animation to understand better. Follow the wiring lines, the devices utilized, and its functions. If you have any questions or part of the video is unclear for you, don't hesitate to post it in the comment section and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. As the saying goes, knowledge is power. The more you understand your home's electrical layout, the smarter and safer your home becomes. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Tetch Shea's video notebook. Comment below if you have questions about your smart switch setup and see you in the next video.